Hello everybody, and thank you for joining me today. As you can see, things are a little bit different. I am not doing a writing stream or anything like that. In fact, this is a recorded video that I am doing, and that is going to be a pansexual goth reacting to pansexual TikTok compilations. So yeah, I'm going to be reacting to pansexual TikTok compilations because, yeah. The thing is, is I'm doing this partially because I finally found pride, like, clothing that I like kind of thing. It's never really been in my style, if you can't tell. Um, so, I, it, cause it's all just, it's a lot of rainbows, which, which is, you know, great, great for some people, just not my thing. Not my thing when it's just rainbows, you know, and it's a lot of white and pink and purple, which I like purple, but darker purple. So yeah, I, I saw, I found this and another shirt. The other shirt is black with rainbow hearts and it says, be proud. I don't, I, I honestly just, I didn't realize it said be proud. I saw the rainbow hearts and the black and I was like, sold. And then I saw this one behind it and I was like, double sold. And they were on sale. It was great. So yeah, the only problem with this is it tracks cat hair like no tomorrow, but I can live with that. We're going to start this and stuff. Oh, I should take my little banner up here down. I'm not really used, again, not used to recording and stuff. So sorry guys, I'm going to take that. But now you guys know all my socials and stuff. If you want to find me and follow me, ha ha ha. Okay. Order. I'm gonna let me know what we're doing. There we go. And now I want this to come back up. So I will say, I will link what I use down below. Actually, I should probably, I need to do one other thing. I just realized. <laughs> Again, sorry guys. <laughs> this is going to make for an interesting recording later. Okay. Got that up. Cool. Got this up. Sort of. Need to put it up here. Okay. We're good now. Do one other thing. There. Okay, so I sort of started watching this one just to do a test. It worked fine. So we're going to go from here. We're going to watch these. Again, I will link all the stuff below when I'm, you know, done doing this up and everything. So let's go and watch a TikTok compilation. I'm also going to say the name of this after it's done. And we'll go from there. So yeah, it just says pansexual TikTok compilation. Um, the name of this person on this TikTok is Miss MRXE1A. I don't know. Okay. Pansexual stereotypes we need to break. Okay. Uh, my camera's like up here because of how I set up is. I'm on my bed as usual because unfortunately I don't really have a place for a desk. I live in a tiny, tiny apartment with my children because, well, if you guys have been watching me, I don't know. Um, I'm disabled. So I don't work. This is all I can do aside from looking after my kids. And even this takes a lot of out of me, which is why I don't do it very often, which is why I'm new to this. So let's go here see what we can do back to where was this is probably way too loud when i think about it yeah no we're gonna turn that down a little there we go that should be fine and go Okay, I'm gonna go back a bit and let you guys hear this one because this one doesn't have any music. So let's just back her up a tiny, tiny bit. Where is the... Okay. There we go. What is this? It's like the word, weird word games. I like that one. Okay. Oh, it's earrings. Okay. Uh, let's see. I've got this is to try not to laugh because I would have just lost. <laughs> just the, the dead pan delivery of I'm not straight. <laughs> I'm sorry. Oh, like I was expecting something, but not that. Well, maybe not that kind of delivery with that. <laughs> okay, next. 
Actually, I should show you guys that one because that was. So, yeah, um. Should I go back and do that? Well, I just told you what he said. You guys can watch it. I'm gonna link it. Okay, next. What? What? I mean, I know what m muffins equate to, but what? I mean, sure, I checked them out, but I don't scream in my head, but to each their own, I guess. Um, on we go. <laughs> I'm not gonna laugh at that pun. I'm not gonna laugh at that pun because I've heard it so many times before. Well, read it more than heard it, I should say. Let's go. What is this? Is he doing like a stamp thing? What is this? I don't know what that was, but it looked cool. Pan vibes. Huh, yeah. Oh, yeah. I wish, because I didn't... I don't know if I should tell you guys that's... Should I tell a story? Should I? Shouldn't I? Why not? So I didn't actually realize I was allowed to like girls until I was a teenager. <laughs> um, just because it had never been floated across to me as like an acceptable idea, I guess. So it didn't really occur in my head, even though I, I realized, I, I sort of realized I did, like I had that sort of like attraction, but I never let myself think about like being with girls till I was like, God, I gotta be like 13, 14. And I've been thinking about like being with boys for a bit longer than that. Since like 11, 12, around in there. Um, and as for like just everybody else on the spectrum, well, I just didn't know because I hadn't met enough people what I was attracted to. And after meeting and seeing a variety of people, I realized I was what I am. So there's that little story. Let's keep going. Okay, I will back this one up because it's actually, where is it? Here we go. I want you guys to hear this guy. I think this is going to be interesting. Okay, fair, fair, yeah, yeah, just leave the man be, leave the man be, and back to it. What is this? It looks interesting. Some kind of sculpture, I'm betting. This is so cool. Is she- she's carving- is it wax? Is this wax carving? This is so neat. It's really pretty. What are you making, girl? Well, it might not be girl. We're gonna listen to this one, too. Because we can. Okay. No. No. I always was just really into purple. Just like 
really into purple. Still am. If, well, it's faded, but the bottom of this is supposed to be purple. Like, at the, like, this part is supposed to be like, it's like a, the two layer thing where like, the bottom is a different color than the, the top part. So it's supposed to be like black and purple, but the purple kind of faded before the black. That's why it's just kind of a sort of dark brown color at this point. Yeah. Cool. That didn't know that. That was actually kind of cool if that's actually true. This is actually kind of cute! Oh, that's, that's actually really cute! And now I'm kind of crying. God damn it! <laughs> My makeup is gonna be ruined! I don't know how well you guys can see this, but it's like... It's there. There are tears. <laughs> that was so cute. Like... My heart. <laughs> Oh, I didn't think this would- oh my god, I, well, I thought maybe, but, oh, oh well, let's go on. <laughs> I have- no idea what that was, but okay. <laughs> kind of funny. Where's this gonna go? What is it with the, the pan? That does it moves. Very nice dance moves. Like, I could not do that, but then again, my spine is fused. So, moving on from that. But yeah, no. More pan puns that I thought I'd find already in the first one. Let's keep going. Aw. Doing her shoes up all nice. That's cool. Doggy! Oh god, this. It's that, um, what is his name? That right wing guy. He's got like a, he's like an it's got like a show thing. What is his name? It's the frog's gay thing. The frog's gay guy. I can't remember what his name is. That really bothers me. I won't include the, the audio from this because again, I don't know if it's covered. I don't think it is, but... What is his name? I can't remember his name. You guys know who I'm talking about. It would be so, so cool if a frog with that coloring was somehow found in the wild. That would be cool. Just a thought. Let's get back to it. Like, in my, in my head, it's like, F, she's right. I'm not going to say the actual swear word, because you're not supposed to swear on YouTube. But yeah. I have so many friends. That, the thing is, a lot of my friends are pansexual. How does that work? 
back to this. Let's keep going. Isn't that always the question? Ah, <laughs> uh, You gotta wonder those things. I wonder how many people do wonder those things. And I'm not going to answer if I have or not. You can probably figure it out. Let's keep going. That is pretty funny, though. <laughs> yes, and also for other reasons. Because <laughs> I... Anyway, we're going to keep going. <laughs> I'm socially awkward. And... Well... Let's keep going. Again, I'm so glad this is not a try not to laugh. Oh, let's keep going. Cuddles are awesome. With consent. But yes, cuddle arts are awesome. Especially from the right people. Back to this. Hmm? What are you gonna get? I want... Was... I'm assuming it was right. Be cool if it was. There was also like the, the gender flags on there, I think. Like, I'm pretty sure I saw the non bi non-binary flag on there which is different from like anyway back to this oh that's nice okay these are just pictures okay I can probably show that I not surprised there some of these are obvious, others not so much, or I don't even know the person. Who? I'm showing my age here, guys. What's this in here? I remember that stereotype growing up. The funny thing was, it never seemed to affect me or my bi friends because of, like, we just weren't those types as far as I knew. Well, at least I, well, I should say pan and bi friends because, like, I thought I was bi when I was younger, but I'm actually pan, as I've said earlier. But, yeah, that was a thing, but I don't remember us, like, I don't know. I might not have known enough about their personal lives to really comment on that, but from what I remember now. Okay, let's keep going. Oh, uh, just the, like the others were so calm and this one is so angry. It's like, like, that one, that's like, give it to me all. Like, literally just, just the whole smorgasbord all at once. See? Oh. She's very pretty. Probably way too young for me. I'm in my 30s. But very pretty. I, I like the whole the whole look. Really suits her. Really suits her.
Like, that, that is not a valid reason to take away somebody's child. As somebody who has... That pisses me off. I went to college to be a child and youth worker. You don't do that. I know the reasons you take kids away from families. And there are reasons that are unjustified that have happened, like, because where I live, you don't do this. Sorry, sorry, that, that hits very close to home, because I have kids, and I'm part of, like, I'm gender fluid, so I'm not trans. I, I can only imagine, oh god, let, let's finish this before I turn into a complete blubbering mess. Oh, thank god. Oh, thank god. I hope you win. I hope you won. I hope you- I hope you won that. D d that they should have nothing on you. That is not a valid reason to do this. Ever. Very true. Very true. Like, if those people didn't have those views, those, those very, I'm not, the wording I want to use here, I probably can't, but I'm sure you all know. If those people did not have those views, that family would be okay, and that little boy would not be in the middle of this. They are the ones that are like the. Can I say victims? Am I allowed to say victims? Like, you don't do that. That kid is. You've now put that kid through so much that was so unnecessary. Just because somebody. Like. You know, like. I really wish people would understand that your brain does so much to you. Like, as someone who, like, I've also, I didn't think I'd go this far into things in the first video, guys. <laughs> Sorry. So I'm also somebody who wanted to be a psychologist, of, or like, psychologist, psychiatrist kind of thing at one point. Like, I wanted to originally be a doctor when I was a kid. Don't have the math smarts. So I wanted to be a psychologist. And so I've, I've studied this stuff. Like, even though I never got to do it, I, I still kept up with, the, I still keep up with the literature. I still read about this stuff. Like, your, your brain is amazing. The things it can it can do, the things it, it's capable of, and the fact that we can even be born this way, and even exist in this universe in the ways that we do, and you're willing to, to do this over it? To, to hurt so many things just because you don't understand or think it's right. When really it doesn't hurt anybody because these were two consenting adults. And well, yes, there was a child in that relationship. That child only saw love. Like, that is such a depth of couple and self-love that you have to have to do that. To, to not only realize what you are, but to come out and have your spouse accept you like that. And to try and take a child away with all of that there when none of it is harmful is so wrong like that that could have been such a wholesome teaching thing such a good experience and you've now completely wrecked it all because you didn't agree with something that you chose not to understand i'm sorry guys i didn't expect to get like this i'm so <laughs> i hope you Let's see. Can you guys see me? Can you guys see how messed up I am right now? No, nope, not at all. <laughs> well, that's good at least. I did I did this on purpose. <laughs> okay, well, let's get back to this gorgeous woman. 
who again is probably way too young for me to view in any manner other than saying she's really pretty. So yeah, um, let's keep going before I continue. Ooh, this is going to be interesting to edit. <sighs> okay, back to, back to this. Gotta love the, the interjected goth chick in there. That was... <laughs> Dad, no boys until you were at least 30 or 40. Oh god, I know where this is going. I can't... I can't read that. What does that say? No... I can't read that. Oh, okay, it's done. Okay, next one. Time to watch slash listen to this. What? The lesbian? Was it an owl? What? I'm so confused. Again, I'm probably showing my age. This is probably some Gen. I'm technically a millennial, I think. This is probably some Gen Z thing, I would imagine, by looks of the age of the person. Not that I want to assume the age, but they look fairly young. So, let's keep going. Actually, ooh. um. I think, I think all but one of my grandmothers, including my great-grandmothers, probably would have been accepting of me. They were actually very nice ladies. But, you know, whatever things out there, higher powers rest their soul. Either way, let's keep going. I'm not sure what that means in the full context, but okay. I mean, I know what it means in the context of gay men, but not if there's some other meaning to it in, like, the full context of things, if you get my drift. I don't know if there's a drift to get on that one. Is there? Whatever. We'll just keep going. My brain now wondering if I'm omnisexual or pansexual. I I don't care about gender, technically. Like, I do notice it in a way, I think. Maybe. Maybe that's more of a societal conditioning thing. I don't know. But, yeah. Not sure. Let's keep going. I'd say I would be omni then if anything, so far. I can't, I don't know. Oh, okay, that's just what...
they're not stacked. They were earlier. I had like another thing on this arm, but they're like these ones. So does that count? I also have bangles that I sometimes wear. So maybe. Same. Same. I feel that. I feel that so much. Oh. My kids and I are all neurodivergent. And it affects our taste buds. Like all of us. I don't even like vegetables that much. But I do eat what I can. Although currently I... Actually no, I'm not going to go into that. I saw the text, but... But they're basically saying, like, they're gonna check off all the boxes of the different, like, genders they like and things. Oh! Now they're saying they don't have a chance with any of them. I think they're cute. Again, way too young. Way too young. But you probably have a chance with somebody. I I'd say you do. Like, like... I don't know. Let's keep going. That last bit. Come and get a taste. Again, too young. And I'm taken, actually, so... Why have I not said that up until now? You guys all know this. Alright, keep going. Again, probably way too young. Again, very pretty. I've literally never seen... I've never even heard of this show. I... I mostly just watch YouTube and read manga on my phone. So I probably won't know show references if they come up. Let's keep going here. Okay, so this has... The one I just described about the checking all the boxes one as the audio. Still the music's there. But now they're doing whatever this is. Oh, they're making like... What? What is that program? Oh, God. I think that... It's the audio from, like, it, I'm pretty sure I can't put it on, but it's, I guess, sort of weird song from, I think it's Rick and Morty. It's like Stan and I was wrong in how, is how it started. I don't know. Again, I don't watch the show. Cute button. Nice slinky tricks, I will say that. Like, wow. How do you even do that? Like, how? Fair, fair. This is like a bunch of like TikToks all stuck together from this one person. Oh, 
Oh, that's nice. That's very nice of them to explain all that. Also, really cool yo-yo tricks. Like, that was amazing. I've never... Like, I know you can do stuff with yo-yos, but that was just... Wow. I guess I can see that logic. Let's keep going. Why? Okay, well, that was... I love her choker. That last one was kind of like, what the heck? But, okay. Love this. Love that, that collar. I don't know what that was. Oh, they went down. That's actually, is that genius? Like, I know, I know it's called coming out of the closet. <laughs> Let's keep going. That that was still. I hope they didn't hurt themselves. So there's a song going, and every now and then it goes woo, and that's basically when they're doing this, the timing wise. I never heard this song. Again, there's like a thing that's something about Pikaru? I don't know. Another reference to something I don't know. Oh! It's like, was that a weird thing from Harry Potter? I think that's what that was. It was like a pick the, the twin thing. Like when Fred and George and Harry Potter do the, or no, is that Fred and George? Oh no, I know what that's from. That's from Oran High School Host Club. That's what that's from. Still weird to hear it. I probably can't. I don't know if I can, but yeah, that, 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 that was an Oran High School host club thing where they do the pick the twin thing. That That's what that was. Uh, yes, I have read Oran High School host club. All of it. Never watched the anime. I have read the entire manga. Back to this. Let's see. And we've seen we've seen how many pan puns like pan involved TikToks in this thing. That's like that whole we're not gonna go there. No. Now she looks old enough that I can say yes, she is attractive. And be like, yeah, but again, I'm taken. I can still. Yeah. Yeah. Never mind. Oh, it's a bath bomb. don't know if this is copyright but we're not gonna put it anyway basically it's it's probably just her with a ukulele talk like she's singing about being pansexual basically <laughs> cute well good for you for being proud you're 
That's quite the name. There's already no sound to this. There's no sound for me. So there's already no sound for you guys. So pansexual non-binary. I say gender fluid for myself, but most of these people are attractive so far. At least to me anyway. Some... I don't know. I have my own preferences. <gasps> Yay! That's really nice to see. Like we like we have pride stuff here usually. I live in Canada. Mostly you find it at Walmart. This I found in the mall where I live, which is not near well, it's near one Walmart. But yeah. Let's keep watching. Oh, they have all the... Now that I have not seen. I've only really seen the rainbow ones here. That's really nice. That's really cool. I like that. Go this target. Like, I would have bought... Like, I know, I, d I say I don't like Pride stuff, but usually, like, because of the way it's, it is, aesthetically. Um, but some of that stuff was nice. I would buy some of that stuff, so. Oh, I, I probably would, too. Oh, no! How much have you straightened your hair, girl? I do nothing to my hair for this very reason. Because my hair is very fine. Like, all I have ever done is dyed it and bleached it once. I will never bleach it again. That was to dye it blue. But yeah, I just took to darker colors because my hair is a fairly light color naturally. Like, it's like dark blonde. So not too bad to dye as long as I stick to darker colors. Let let's see how bad she did this to her hair. Eight times. What? One why, two how, three over the course of how much time? Let's find out. Same for me, guys. Same for me. Good for her. Wasn't expecting that. Wasn't expecting that. Wait, do I have the sound on? Yes. You guys all heard that. <laughs> Sticks. <laughs> oh! I have an asexual friend. Oh, he probably loved that. <laughs> oh! He's posted some really funny memes on Facebook. Like, bangers. Oh. Uh, okay. I think we're actually going to end things here. Like, we're going to finish watching this little one, but yeah. Okay, that, that was the last one. That was literally the last one, guys. Okay, so we're going to end it here. Thank you all for watching. I hope you had a good time with this. I certainly have, aside from the abject rage at that one. Oh, that pisses me off. What? My fiance just walked in, guys. I'm still recording. Give me a minute. Hi, everyone. Uh, but yeah, no, that's just, I'm not going to comment on it anymore, guys. I, I think I said enough. But yeah, I hope that person, that they were successful and nothing 
really bad happened and I wish them the best and everybody else for that matter from all of the stuff. So yeah, thanks for watching. Please follow me on all that stuff. Subscribe, like, comment, all that fun stuff. And I'll see you guys next time and bye!